back to my YouTube channel. Okay, you guys, so today my mom will be rating all of the boys that I have dated. This video is probably gonna be pretty awkward, but if you guys are excited, be sure to give it a big thumbs up right now and let's get this video started. Woo! So I'm gonna ask my mom if she's down to rate these guys, but before I do, I'm gonna do a little tattoo prank because it wouldn't be a video with my mom without pranking her first, so let's do it. All right, tattoo reveal. <laughs> Okay, so obviously the tattoo says mom, and uh, let's just say hopefully I still have an arm after this prank. Um, she might like it. Or she might cut off my arm. So uh, let's get a reaction. All right, let's do it. Mom! Yeah. Can you come down here? What's up? I wanted to see if you could be in my video today. Sure. Okay, but first I'm gonna record your reaction to something. I have a surprise for you. Oh, is it a good surprise? It's a good surprise. Okay. Okay, you ready? I'm ready. Three, two, one. Is that tattoo? Yeah. You got a tattoo. Yeah, yeah. And that's on your arm. You can see that anytime. If you have to go to a job interview, I mean, there. You, I mean, unless you wear long sleeves. Now, did you think about it? I I thought about it long and hard. I mean, oh I my you goodness! Just flattered. It says mom on it. Well, I mean, I'm glad you picked my name, but I'm definitely not flattered. I mean. I honestly thought you'd be more mad. I'm pretty mad. I thought you, earlier today I was like, oh, my mom's probably gonna cut my arm off. Yeah, that's kind of a good idea. What? Where are the scissors? No, it was a joke. Oh my gosh, she actually has the scissors. Ah! Stop! Stop, it's a prank. It's a prank. It's a prank. The tattoo's a prank? <laughs> it's, a, it's a fake tattoo. Oh my gosh, let's see. I like my name there though. Okay, then I'll actually get a no, tattoo no, no, with no. you. Okay, Mom, well, now that I have you here, I wanted to see if you would be down to rate some of the guys that I have dated. Ooh, see, I would love that. that okay, fun. let's do that. Okay. So there's going to be a little bit of a twist. Basically, my mom is going to be rating all of the guys that I've dated according to the internet. So I'm sure you guys know, but there have been a lot of assumptions about who I'm dating and who I've dated. So today, we're going to dive into those assumptions, and my mom is going to rate each guy. I cannot wait. This sounds like fun. All right, let's Let's do it. Okay, so first things first, we're gonna start off with a good old Google search. So, I'm gonna search who is Lexi Rivera dating. <laughs> oh my gosh. You used to say you're dating. It's literally a big old Andrew Davila. <laughs> I love Andrew. Okay, so basically this little article here, this valid source says, it doesn't seem like she's officially seeing someone, but she may be romantically linked to influencer Andrew Davila. Um, but yeah, basically when you search that, Andrew's name pops up. So, he's the first guy that you're gonna be rating. Okay. Because apparently, I'm dating Andrew. So have you ever <laughs> dated Andrew? <laughs> now horrible. that's none of your business. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Well, okay, so I have to rate him. So tall, dark, and handsome, totally adorable. So on a scale of one to 10, I mean, I, I would love to probably give all these guys 10s. I know I can't do so, that. So uh, Some of these guys you don't even know. Some of these guys I don't even know, you guys. Oh, really? Yes. Okay, so on a scale, I think since we're just starting off and Andrew's the first person, I have to leave a little room, I guess. I don't know, maybe an eight? An eight, okay. So, no, let's give it a nine. Okay, so Andrew gets a nine. Okay. Um, a stamp of approval from my mom. <laughs> okay, next up, we're going to be taking a look at a video titled, Lexi Rivera dating Dom Brack after a Ben Azelart breakup. This seems a little absurd. <laughs> so here it seems that they have evidence that Dom and I are together. Dom made an Instagram video with her. In the first ever appearance on Dom's Instagram account, Dom snapped back and forth with oh Lexi, asking her on a date. And when she said no, he said, quote, wait, what did I say? She replied, quote, do you want a date? To which he said, quote, I thought you'd never ask. What, like what, this is, the, this is their evidence, you guys. In July, Lexi posted a video oh called Drinking Friend Who Has a Crush On. You guys and in the video she invents set up. He's the one who has a crush on her. Andrew just texted this one. Maybe you were going out with Andrew. Ben and Lexi aren't talking anymore, and honestly, he seemed pretty happy about it. Dom even tried to comfort Lexi after <laughs> So basically they got their evidence from a bunch of our YouTube videos. So um, with that being said, the next person that I am dating or have dated is Dom, according to the internet. So mom, will you rate Dom? I will. First, I think he's really cute, but doesn't he simp for everyone? Don't you guys say that like, oh. <laughs> I think he 
is really sweet. I love his blue eyes, dark hair. Mm -hmm. I think he has good morals. Okay. I'm going to give him a seven because I think he's too young for you. He's still in high school, isn't he? Yes, Dom is a baby. Okay. All right, so my mom rated Dom a seven, so let's move on to the next victim. <laughs> Okay, moving on, I have a link here, and it says that I have been in two relationships, one of those relationships being with a guy named Hayes Greer. Um, do you know who Hayes Greer is? Because I've never met him. I do not know who Hayes Greer is, but he's really cute. Okay, so let's learn a little bit more about Hayes Greer so that you can give him a rating. Okay. Um, so he's 20 years old, and it says that he's also been in two relationships with me and Kalani Hilliker, okay? Um, well, maybe it's meant to be. I mean, if it, you know, the internet really never lies. <laughs> All of these have been a lie. I haven't dated any of these guys so far. I mean, you'd be cute together, same age. I mean, you're a little bit younger and mm -hmm. he's very cute. I'll give him a five because I would love to know more about him. That's a pretty good score for someone you've never met. Yeah, I've never met him, so I really have no idea. All right, so here we have a video titled Lexi Rivera and Ben Aslart dating again. What are you guys doing? We're rating all of the people that I've dated according to the internet. So mom's gonna rate Ben right now. Uh, I'll rate Ben a two. <laughs> what? Brandon, you're Aww. so hard on Ben. Leave Sorry, him alone. Ben. Hopefully my mom gives him a better score. Oh, I'll definitely give him a better score. Okay, well we are going to take a look at this video and see what they have to say um, as to why me and Ben are dating again. Are Lexi Rivera and Ben Azler back <laughs> together? We'll fill you in on Lexi's most recent YouTube video. Oh my gosh. Look how cute you guys are. You guys are cute. Over the weekend, Lexi posted a video to her YouTube channel titled, Who is the Best Couple? Lexi I love and Ben Azler. If you didn't know, Lexi and Ben dated for years and decided to call it quits in November after posting a video titled, We You should have reacted to our breakup video because my mom cried to our breakup video. Oh my God, I totally <laughs> cried. <laughs> The two are definitely still friends, Aww. and there could be a possibility that they will get back together yeah. in the future. Okay, so that's enough for this video. So basically, to sum up that video, um, they're making the assumption that Ben and I are getting back together based on a recent video, but Ben is actually the only person listed on the internet that I actually have dated, so mom, give him your rating. Okay, so Ben holds a special place in my heart because okay. you, you guys did date a long time, and you guys were so young and so cute. I think Ben gets a 9.5. Wow! And I would love to give him a 10, but I'm just gonna say if you guys get back together, then maybe we'll see how it goes. But right now right. we're at a 9.5. Okay, so the only person that I've actually dated gets a whopping 9.5. So therefore, the highest score so far. All right, you guys, so obviously there are a lot of assumptions about who I'm dating and who I've dated, but I've decided that that's all the guys that we're gonna get to today. We're not gonna talk about any of the guys in high school? No. Oh, come on. Please, no. Oh, what about David Dobrik? I heard you guys totally hit it off. David Dobrik. Let me rate him. I'll rate no, him. No, I'll rate him for you. 10 out of 10. <laughs> okay, you guys, that is going to be it for this week's video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it, and if you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up, and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and I will see you guys next week. Bye.